our God, always now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Glory to thee, our God. Glory to thee. God of linking, comfort, and spirit of truth, for everywhere present, and close all things. Treasure and good things, and giver of life, come and dwell in us, and cleanse us of all impurity, and save our souls with good Holy God, holy, mighty, holy, immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy, mighty, holy, immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy, mighty, holy, immortal, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. O most holy Trinity, have mercy on us, O Lord. Blot out our sins, O Master. Pardon our iniquities, O Holy One. Visit and heal our infirmities for thy name's sake. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, who art in the heavens, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. And is the kingdom and the power and the glory of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Lord of mercy, 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 Lord of mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. O come, let us worship God our King. O come, let us worship and fall down before Christ our King and God. O come, let us worship and fall down before Christ himself, our King and God. How be over thy dwellings, O Lord of hosts, my soul long be confaked for the courts of the Lord. My heart and my flesh have rejoiced in the living God. For the sparrow hath found herself a house, and the turtle dove a nest for herself, where she may lay her young. Even thine altars, O Lord of hosts, my King and my God. Blessed are they that dwell in thy house, and through ages of ages shall they praise thee. Blessed is the man whose help is from thee. He hath made his hands in his heart, and the veil of weeping in the place which he hath appointed. I wish for the law of your gold and blessings. They shall go from strength to strength to God. God shall be seen in silence. O Lord, of hosts, hearken to my prayer. O dear, O God of Jacob, O God, our defender, behold, and look upon the face of thine anointed one. For better is one day in thy courts than thousands elsewhere. I have chosen rather to be an outcast in the house of my God than to dwell in the tents of sinners. For the Lord loveth mercy and truth. God will give grace and glory. The Lord will not withhold good things from them that walk in innocence. O Lord God of hosts, blessed is the man that hopeth in thee. Thou hast been gracious, O Lord, unto thy land. Thou hast turned back the captivity of Jacob. Thou hast forgiven the iniquities of thy people. Thou hast covered all their sins. Thou hast made all thy wrath to cease. Thou hast turned back from the wrath of thine anger. Turn us back, O God, of our salvation, and turn away thine anger from us. Wilt thou be wroth with us into the ages, or wilt thou draw out thy wrath from generation to generation? <clears throat> o God, thou wilt turn and quicken us, and thy people shall be glad in thee. Show us, O Lord, thy mercy and thy salvation do thou give unto us. I will hear what the Lord God will speak in me, for he will speak peace to his people and to his saints, and to them that turn their heart unto him. Surely not unto them that fear him is his salvation, that glory may dwell in our land. Mercy and truth are met together, righteousness and peace have kissed each other. Truth is sprung out of the earth, and righteousness hath looked down from heaven. Yea, for the Lord will give goodness in our land, shall yield her fruit. Righteousness shall go before him, and shall set his footsteps in the way. Bow down, then, your Lord, and hearken unto me, for poor and needy am I. Preserve my soul, for I am holy. Save thy servant, O my God, that hopeth in thee. Have mercy on me, O Lord, for unto thee will I cry all the day long. Make glad the soul of thy servant, for unto thee have I lifted up my soul. For thou, O Lord, art good and gentle, and plenteous and mercy as well, and to call upon me. Give your O Lord unto my prayer, and attend unto the voice of my supplication. In the day of mine affliction have I cried unto thee, for thou hast heard me. There is none like unto thee among the gods, O Lord, nor are there any works like unto thy works. All the nations whom thou hast made shall come and shall worship before thee, O Lord, and shall glorify thy name. For thou art great and workest wonders, thou alone art God. Guide me, O Lord, in thy way, and I will walk in thy truth. Let my heart rejoice that I may fear thy name. And I will confess thee, O Lord, and my God, with all my heart, and I will glorify thy name forever. <coughs> For great is thy mercy upon me, and thou hast delivered my soul from the nethermost Hades. O God, transgressors have risen up against me, and the assembly of the mighty had sought after my soul, and they have not set thee before them. But thou, o Lord, my God, art compassionate and merciful, long-suffering, plenteous in mercy and true. 
Look upon me and have mercy upon me. Give thy strength unto thy servant and save the son of thy handmaiden. Work in me a sign of the good and let them that hate me behold and be put to shame for thou who hast spoken me and comforted me. Work in me a sign unto good and let them that hate me behold and be put to shame for thou who hast spoken me and comforted me. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Hallelujah, 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 glory to thee, O God. Hallelujah, 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 glory to thee, O God. Hallelujah, 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 glory to thee, O God. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. The head of the forerunner with that which hath shown forth from the earth that shed rays of incorruption and healing upon the faithful. On high it assembleth a multitude of angels, and below it falleth upon the human race to send up glory with one voice to Christ God. O thou never and unto the ages of ages, Amen. O thou for our sake was born of a virgin and didst suffer crucifixion, O good one. And didst despoil death by death, and as God didst reveal the resurrection. Stay not them which thou hast fashioned with thy hand, show forth thy love for mankind, O merciful one. Except the Theotokos who gave thee birth and interceded for us, and thou our Savior, save a despairing people. Deliver us not utterly for thy holy name's sake, neither disannul thou thy covenant, and cause not thy mercy to depart from us for Abraham's sake, thy beloved, for Isaac's sake, thy servant, and for Israel's thy holy one. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Holy God, holy mighty, holy immortal, have mercy on us. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. The most holy Trinity, have mercy on us, O Lord. Blot out our sins, O Master, pardon our iniquities. O Holy One, visit and heal our infirmities for thy name's sake. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. Thanks, the kingdom, and the power, and the glory of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Seeing the author of life hanging on the cross, the thief said, Were it not God incarnate who was crucified with us, the sun would not have been its rays, nor would the earth have quaked and trembled, but to thou who endurest all things, remember me, O Lord, in thy kingdom. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. In the midst of two thieves, thy cross was found to be a balance of justice, for the one was born bound to Hades by the way of his blasphemy. The other was raised up from his sins to the knowledge of theology, O Christ God, glory be to thee, both now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. When she who bare the Lamb and Shepherd and Savior of the world beheld him on the cross, she said with tears, The world rejoices at that receiving redemption, but my bowels burn as I see that crucifixion which thou endurest for all, O my Son and my God. Mercy, 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 mercy. What a mercy, 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 what Follows all the salvation through the promise of good things to come. Receive, O Lord, our prayers at this hour and guide our life towards thy commandment. Sanctify our souls, make taste our bodies, correct our thoughts, purify our intentions, and deliver us from every sorrow, evil, and pain. Encompass us about with thy holy angels, that guarded and guided by their maintain to the unity of the faith and the knowledge of thine unapproachable glory. For blessed art thou unto the ages of ages, amen. Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy, Lord have mercy. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. More honorable than the cherubim, and beyond compare, more glorious than the seraphim. Without corruption, give us birth to God the Word, the very Theotokos, do we magnify. In the name of the Lord, Father, bless. Be gracious unto us, and bless us, and cause thy face to shine upon us, and have mercy on us. Amen. Oh,
master of my life, the spirit of idleness, despondency, ambition, and idle talk. And then the spirit of chastity, humble-mindedness, patience, and love will still upon me, my servant. You know, Lord King, ready to see my own feelings and not condemn my brother, those that I found to be ages of ages. Amen. O Master, Lord Jesus Christ, our God, who art long suffering in the face of our transgress- transgressions and was brought us even unto this present hour, where God is hanging upon the life giving tree and did <clears throat> make a way into paradise for the wise thief, and by death did destroy death. Be gracious unto us, sinners, and thy unworthy servants. For we have sinned and committed iniquity and are not worthy to lift up our eyes and behold the height of heaven. For we have abandoned the way, the way of thy righteousness and have walked in the desires of our hearts. We beseech thy boundless goodness, spare us, O Lord, according to the multitude of thy mercy, and save us for thy holy name's sake. For our days were consumed in vanity. Rescue us from the hand of the adversary, and forgive us our sins, and mortify our carnal mind, that putting aside the old man we may be clad with the new, and live for thee, our master and benefactor, and that thus by following in thy commandments we may attain to rest everlasting, where it is the dwelling place of all them that rejoice. Thou art indeed the true joy and gladness of them that love thee, O Christ our God. And unto thee do we send up glory with thy unurgent Father, and thy most holy and good and life creating spirit, now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Blessed is our God, and now and ever and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Come, let us worship God our King. Come, let us worship and fall down before Christ our King, God. Come, let us worship and fall down before Christ himself, our King, our God. Bless the Lord, O my soul, O Lord, my God, Thou hast been magnified exceedingly. In fashion and majesty as Thou put on, and coverest Thyself in light as with the garment, who stretchest out the heaven as it were a curtain, who supporteth His chambers in the waters, who appointeth the clouds for His ascent, who walketh upon the wings of the winds, who maketh His angels, his spirits, and His ministers a flame of fire. Who establishes the earth in the sureness thereof, it shall not be turned back forever and ever. The abyss, like a garment, is his mantle. Upon the mountains shall the waters stand. At thy rebuke they will flee, at the voice of thy thunder shall they be afraid. The mountains rise up, and the plains sink down unto the place where thou hast established them. Thou pointest to bound that they shall not pass, neither return to cover the earth. He sendeth forth springs in the valleys, between the mountains where the waters run. They shall give drink to all the beasts of the field, and the wild asses away to quench their thirst. Beside them will the birds of the heaven lodge from the midst of the rocks where they give voice. He watereth the mountains from his chambers, the earth shall be satisfied with the fruit of thy works. He causeth the grass to grow for the cattle and greener for the service of men. To bring forth bread out of the earth, and wine maketh glad the heart of man. To make his face cheer with oil, and bread strengtheneth man's heart. The trees of the plain shall be satisfied, the cedars of Lebanon which thou hast planted. There will the sparrows make their nests, the house of the heron is chief among them. The high mountains are a refuge for the hearts, and so is the rock for the hairs. He hath made the moon for seasons, the sun knoweth his going down. Thou pointest the darkness, and there was the night, wherein all the beasts of the forest will go abroad, young lions roaring after their prey, and seeking their food from God. The sun ariseth, and they are gathered together, and they lay them down in the den. But man shall go forth unto his work, and to his labor until the evening. How magnified are thy works, O Lord, and wisdom hast thou made them all. The earth is filled with thy creation, and so is this great and spacious sea. There are things creeping innumerable, small living creatures with the great. There go the ships, there this dragon, and thou hast made to play therein. All things wait on thee to give them their food in due season. When thou givest to them, they will gather it. When thou openest thy hand, all things shall be filled with goodness. When thou turnest away thy face, they shall be troubled. Thou wilt take their spirit, and they shall cease, and unto their dust to their return. Thou wilt send forth thy spirit, and they shall be created, and thou shalt renew the face of the earth. Let the glory of the Lord be unto the ages, the Lord rejoice in his works. He looketh on the earth, and maketh it tremble, and toucheth the mountains, and they smoke. I will sing unto the Lord throughout my life, I will chant to my God for as long as I have my being. 
May my words be sweet unto him, and I will rejoice in the Lord. Oh, that sinners would cease from the earth, and they that work iniquity, that they should be no more. Bless the Lord, O my soul. The sun knoweth his going down, now blind is the darkness, and there was the night. How magnified are thy works, O Lord, in wisdom hast thou made them all. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever and unto thee, as it is on end. Adi the Adi the Adi the Adi, glory to thee, O God. Adi the Adi the Adi the Adi, glory to thee, O God. Adi the Adi the Adi the Adi, glory to thee, O God. Peace let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Peace from above and the salvation of our souls. Let us pray to the Lord. of the holy churches of God and the union of all let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. For this holy temple and for them that with faith, reverence, and the fear of God enter herein, let us pray to the Lord. Lord have mercy. For our great Lord and Father, his holiness patriarch here. For our Lord, the very most reverend Metropolitan Hilarion, first hierarch of the Russian Church abroad, for the venerable priesthood, the diaconate in Christ, for all the clergy and people, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For our all venerable Father, the abbot of this holy monastery, Archimandrite Seraphim, and all his brethren in Christ, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For this land, its authorities, and armed forces, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For the God preserved Russian land and its Orthodox people, both in the homeland and in the diaspora, and for their salvation. Let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For this holy monastery, for every city and country, and the faithful that dwell therein, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. For seasonable weather, abundance of the fruits of the earth, and peaceful times, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Travelers by sea, land, and air, for the sick, the suffering, the imprisoned, and for their salvation, <laughs> let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. And may be delivered from all tribulation, <laughs> wrath, and necessity, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, have mercy. Help us, save us, have mercy on us, and keep us, O God, by thy grace. Lord, have mercy. Calling in remembrance our most holy, most pure, most blessed, glorious, and Theotokos, and ever virgin Mary with all the saints, let us commit ourselves and one another in all thy life unto Christ our God.
For there will I sit to judge all the nations round about. Bring forth the sickles, for the vintage is come. Go in, tread, for the press is full. Cause the vats to overflow, for their wickedness is multiplied. Noises have resounded in the valley of judgment. For the day of the Lord is near in the valley of judgment. The sun and the moon shall be darkened, and the stars shall withdraw their light. The Lord shall cry out of Zion, and shall utter his voice from Jerusalem. And the heaven and the earth shall be shaken, but the Lord shall spare his people, and the Lord shall strengthen the children of Israel. And ye shall know that I am the Lord your God, who dwelleth in Zion in my holy mountain. And Jerusalem shall be holy, and strangers shall not pass through her any more. And it shall come to pass in that day that the mountain shall drop sweet wine, and the hills shall flow with milk, and all the fountains of Judah shall flow with water. And a fountain shall go forth of the house of the Lord and water the valley of reeds. Egypt shall be a desolation, and Idumea shall be a desolate plain, because of the wrongs of the children of Judah, because they have shed righteous blood in their land. But Judea shall be inhabited forever in Jerusalem from generation to generation. And I will make an and I will make inquisition for their blood, and will by no means leave it unavenged. And the Lord shall dwell in Zion. The Perkimenon in the sixth tone, let Israel hope in the Lord from henceforth and forevermore. Let Israel hope in the Lord from henceforth and forevermore. O Lord, my heart is not exalted, nor mine eyes become lofty. Let Israel hope in the Lord from henceforth and forevermore. Let Israel hope in the Lord from henceforth and forevermore. Thou sleep, O Lord, keep us this evening without sin. Blessed art thou, O Lord, the God of our fathers, and praise and glorify this thy name into the ages. Amen. Let thy mercy, O Lord, be upon us, supporting as we have hoped in thee. Blessed art thou, O Lord, teach me thy statutes. Blessed art thou, O Master, give me understanding of thy statutes. Blessed art thou, O Holy One, enlighten me by thy statutes. O Lord, thy mercy endureth forever, to stay not the work of thy hands. To thee is to praise, to thee is to a song, to thee glory is due. To the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Guide, the guardian of our souls and bodies, let us ask of the Lord. And this, O Lord, 
pardon and remission of our sins and offenses, let us ask of the Lord. And this, O Lord, things good and profitable for our souls and peace for the world, let us ask of the Lord. And this, O Lord, may complete the remaining time of our life in peace and repentance, let us ask of the Lord. And this, O Lord, our life, nameless, blameless, peaceful, and a good defense before the dread judgment seat of Christ, to let us have calling to remembrance our most holy, most pure, most blessed, glorious, and the Virgin Mary with all the saints. Let us commit ourselves and one another in all our life unto Christ our God. Father, to the Son, and the Holy Spirit, both now and ever, and in the ages of ages. Amen. 
Our Father who art in the heavens, hallowed be thy name. <clears throat> thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our debts, as we forgive our debtors. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from the evil one. Lead us the kingdom and the power and the glory of the Father and the Son and of the Holy
blessed the building of our new church, and that its foundation may be laid successfully to the glory of his name, and that it may be continued speedily without hindrance unto its completion, by the power of operation and grace of the most holy spirit. Let us all say, O Lord, hearken and have mercy. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. And we pray for them that bring offerings and do good works in this holy and all venerable temple. For them that minister and them that chant and for all the people here present, to await to be great and abundant mercy. Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy, Lord, have mercy. More merciful God art thou, the lover of mankind. And unto thee do we send up glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, now and ever, and unto the ages of Amen. Amen. Lord and Master of my life, the spirit of idleness, despondency, and mission, and I will talk from you today. Let our spirit of chastity, humble-mindedness, patience, and love be so upon you, my servant. Be O Lord King, bear me to see my own failings and not finger my brother. Blessed art thou unto the ages of the ages. Amen. For all who return to thee, the consubstantial, the dominion, the indivisible King, the uncaused, and every good, show thy good will even unto me, the sinner, and make steadfast my heart, and grant an understanding, and take away mine every defilement. And light to my mind that I may glorify him, worship and say, One is holy, one is Lord Jesus Christ, to the glory of God the Father, Amen. Blessed be the name of the Lord, and for and forevermore. Blessed be the name of the Lord, and for and forevermore. Blessed be the name of the Lord, and for and forevermore. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, both now and ever and to the age of Amen. I will bless the Lord at all times, his praise shall continually be in my mouth. In the Lord shall my soul be praised, that the meek hear me glad. O oh, magnify the Lord of me, and let us exalt his name together. I sought the Lord, and you heard me, and delivered me from all my tribulations. Come unto him, and be enlightened, and your face and shall not be ashamed. This poor man cried, and the Lord heard him, and saved him out of all his tribulations. The angel of the Lord will encamp round about them, that fear him, and will deal with him. O oh, taste and see, if the Lord is good, blessed is the man that hopeth in him. O oh, fear the Lord, all his saints, for there is no one to them that fear him. Rich men are turned poor and gone hungry, but they that seek the Lord shall not be deprived of any good thing. Come, ye children, hearken unto me, I will teach you the fear of the Lord. What man is there that desireth life, who loveth to see good days? Keep thy tongue from evil, and thy lips from speaking guile. Turn away from evil, and do good, seek peace, and pursue it. The eyes of the Lord are upon the righteous, and his ears are open unto their supplication. The face of the Lord is against them that do evil, utterly to destroy the remembrance of them from the earth. The righteous cried, and the Lord heard them, and he delivered them out of all their tribulations. The Lord is nigh to them, the heart of a contrite heart, and he will save the humble of spirit. Many are the tribulations of the righteous, and the Lord shall deliver them out of them all. The Lord keepeth all their bones, not one of them shall be broken. The death of sinners is evil, and they that hate the righteous shall be wrong. The Lord reading the souls of his servants, and none of them will do wrong their hope in him. Yes, he is truly me to bless you that they are told of God. Whoever bless him, most blameless and mother of our God. Most holy Theotokos, save us. More honorable than the cherubim, and beyond compare more glorious than the seraphim, who without corruption gave us birth to God the Word. The very day of the first year do we magnify. Glory to your Christ, God our hope, glory to thee. Glory to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, who is now and ever, and unto the ages of ages. Amen. Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy, Lord of mercy. Father, God. In Christ our true God, in the intercession of the most pure mother, Power of the precious and life giving cross, to the intercessions of the holy glorious and all praised apostles, of our Father among the saints, Nicholas the Wonder Worker, Archbishop of Nera and Lycia, of the Holy Great Margaret, Healer of Jerusalem, of our Father among the saints, Porphyrius, Archbishop of Gaza, of the holy and righteous ancestors of God, Joachim, Anana, and of all the saints, have mercy on us and save us, for he is good, the lover of mankind. Amen. 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 Amen.